some chips, you better get them quick, and that's why you get them from the SAS and Quick Chips. I am Brandon. That's the Heel Will Mahoney. Snack time, Pally, and we're back to get wise with you again, because today, let me tell you, next generation cheese doodles on tap. That is right. Our friends at Big Lots have done it again. Mm. They keep coming through for the newest and craziest snacks. Today, we have Wise Cheese Doodles Hot and Honey Variety. Now, check out that B on the front there. Mm, he's a beatnik. He looks like a beatnik with his little uh, beanie there and his sweater with the B on it. Got a little honey dipper back here. He's and almost got like a Bobo Alvin and the Chipmunks outfit going on yeah, there. That's little, what I'm noticing. A little bit, a little bit. With the Honey Dipper. What's the buzz about? Back at the hive, everybody's buzzing about the sweet and spicy melt in your mouth taste of hot and honey flavored cheese doodles. Back at the hive. Where's that? Damn, we need to know. I don't know. That's the place to be. Sweet honey <laughs> and a little sting of heat combined with the classic cheese taste of cheese doodles is one unbelievable snack. I love the puns. Right. Bee based puns are always a good time. Now, cheese doodles, Ooh. it's, oh, are they cheesy? They smell like, kind of like chili or something. Are they, oh, really? Yeah. Really? Now, these are hot and honey. Hot and honey. Oh, yeah, they, it smells like barbecue. Yeah, barbecue. Like or sweet, like, like barbecue kind of scent. Definitely not honey. No. It's definitely more like a sweet scent. Now, they're, let's get a good shot of those close up because they're, they're kind of maybe darker than your yeah. average cheese noodle on there. A little bit, I'd yeah, say so. but definitely no honey scent. I'm I'm getting like a barbecue, like kind of sweet smell. Yeah, I'm getting like a peppery sort of chili powder kind of smell. Almost. Yeah, but yeah. not. I would not describe it as honey. Yeah, who knows? No. Well, we'll find out as soon as we pop them in our mouth. Let's do that. Once you pop, you can't stop, baby. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm. I like the flavor so far. I'm looking for the heat. You know what I like? It takes a second for it to kick in. Mm -hmm. You put it in, and I'm like, okay, this has nothing to it. Um, oh, oh, once it kicks in, though, mm -hmm. it's a, wait for it, a new day of flavor. That's right. That's right. It's a new day, <laughs> without a doubt. Mm. These, these, are, these are strong. Please don't be sour. No. Because you're about to see some new power. Damn right. Or whatever it is. Those mm. things are pretty uh, darn amazing. Nice and cheesy. They do have a honey flavor, a little bit of sweetness, and then it kicks you in the butt with the heat. Yeah, the heat comes at the end. It builds nicely. The sweetness, though, is the most overriding part of it. The sweetness is really good. Damn, it's great. I think the only thing, though, is as it does kind of taste like honey. I was trying to think it was it was a sweet honey. It was, there was some other type of sweet flavor, but it's definitely sweet. Yeah, these are these are strong. There is much strength. Tons we strength. said it from the beginning. I hadn't even tasted them yet. These are next level cheese doodles. That's right. Make no doubt about it. It is a new day. From the people who coined the term cheese doodles. There you go. These are definitely the new day of cheese doodles. I have to give these nothing less than a full thumbs up from the heel, Will Mahoney. Yeah, at a dollar a bag. Holy mm. crap, a dollar a bag for these. I mean, come on. Yeah, no. I mean, we almost got shot and stabbed in Fredericksburg mm. trying to get these, but you know, that doesn't matter. Mm. Amazing deal for an amazing product. You're practically stealing them for a dollar a bag. My God, these yeah. are strong. That's mm. right. I think I'm going to go ahead and concur. All the things are in a row. It's crunchy. It's cheesy. It's sweet. It's spicy. Full thumbs up. Home run, baby. Unanimous. Damn mm. straight. You know what else is unanimous? Oh, the joy, the fun, and the wonderful times that we have in the SAS. It's shared unanimously among all of our members. Across all social media networks, on the Facebook, on the Twitter machine, on the Instagrams, Everywhere. We all have a good time when you use hashtag Snack Society for your snack it needs. That's right. And uh, speaking of which, you can catch me at uh, Brandon Reich SAS and him at a Heel Will Mahoney. That's right. You can use that across all the areas. You can use it on the Facebook network, on all kinds of stuff. And you know what you need to do. You know what you need to do. You use the hashtag Snack Society and you use that as we march towards our huge goal of 500K by New Year's Day. We are going to get there and it's going to be with your help. You're the key in this. Not us. 
You, you at home. We'll keep making the videos, you keep watching them, and you'll also join the Four Horsemen of YouTube by liking, favoriting, sharing, and subscribing everything that we do. And in the meantime, in between time, we'll see you next time. Cheese doodles! Cheesy!